Let me know when you're ready. How much harder is it holding down a solo album than it is for a Smith & Wesson album? What's the, uh, are the mechanics different? What is your thought process? The, the mechanics are no different from doing a solo project because I started out as a solo artist. And when I started as a solo artist, Tech was my, my homie. He was just my partner in crime already. And um, later on, you know, because we hung out so thoroughly, it's like I wanted to have a partner. I started out initially, before I was a solo artist, I was, a, I was in a group. Let me show you a picture. Okay. This is exclusive. Nobody saw this, okay? All right. I was in a group with my brother. He, this, this guy, this picture I'm about to sh show you, he started me in rap. Okay. He was like, yo, you're going to be my partner. We're going to have matching Benzes. We're going to have matching limos. Everything going to be black and gold. He loved Rock Kim. So everything with him was black and gold. His name is Chase, right? This is how, how old school is this? Ah. <laughs> uh -oh, oh, look before at the, the oh, Look at the look at the wow. cut. Wow. All right. So there it is. You got it right here, all hip hop exclusive. <laughs> all right. This not even up on my Facebook. This is up nowhere. All right. So this is this is this is how it happened. So before mm. that, you know what I mean. Tech was my partner already, my homie, and then. Me and the homie, you know, he went other ways. So I just said, all right, I'm a, he got me started. I just stayed with it. It felt right. It felt natural. And um, fast forward, Tech became my partner. So it's like, you always had that, growing up kind of in Brooklyn, you always had that kind of survival tactic implemented in your mind. You always had that, all right, what can I do to fit in? Or what can I do to, to, to climb up these particular obstacles that I might be dealing with in the, in the, just in the neighborhood? So, you know, it was no, it was no, um, it was no different really. But I tell you one thing, man, it couldn't have happened without my partner. There's no way that I could do a solo album without my PNC and without my boot camp. So, and I, I, and again, like when we started, you know, Tech and Ruck is two of the pickiest boot campions. You know what I mean? They two of the pickiest rap. Cats, period. Not even rap cat. They two of the pickiest dudes I know. So, to to get them involved was my was my was a challenge for me. You know what I mean? I went to family first, and I needed my family involved, and they blessed me with the best. And um, you know, it was it wasn't it wasn't gonna feel right without having them involved. So it's like you know, I, I of course I wanted to tell my old to Brooklyn, you know, through the general eyes, but it, it's. All the things that I've learned is, is is inclusive with what I've experienced with my brother. So, okay. you know, 